Hi, welcome to automation testing dot in. In this video, we are going to see extent reports log generation in version three of extent reports. Uh, usually, uh, when there is a issue or failure, we want to capture in which screen the exact failure is, and we can place the same information in the extent reports. Okay, then when you look into the report, we'll come to know that uh, after this step. in the screen the test got failed okay it will give more clarity about the execution status for that we will capture the screenshots and we'll try to put into the reports so we have an option or provision uh, in the extent reports to capture the screenshot and place into the extent report so we will see how uh, we can achieve the same thing uh, practically okay i'll go to uh, eclipse first we need to take the screenshot of particular um, step means screen then we have to place somewhere in your folder structure means it is in your machine or your workspace and you have to capture the same thing and place into the extent report this is the procedure okay first you have to capture the screenshot then place the same thing into the extent report for that we need to write a utility class uh, called uh, capture the screenshot or get the screenshot for that we'll write a separate Uh, class i'll i'll name it as what you say uh, get screenshot okay get screenshot it is a utility means whenever there is a need you can capture the screenshot so i am writing as a separate class okay now i'll say public static uh, string capture okay and i need to pass the web driver object i need that web driver object okay and then string and screenshot name i want to put, what name you want to put okay as for that that information also you need to uh, pass to this method we need to add the web driver Okay, we'll 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 take the web driver. We we need to add Selenium jar file for this to add. Uh, I have in this. I do not have in this. I have to add Selenium Selenium add external jars jar files. I have by Apache Okay I have added selenium jar now I can import web driver interface okay now i'll write the logic for take screenshot i am not going to explain all these things i will have a separate video for this and we need to take screenshot of your you have to type cache to driver and uh, file source equal to ts dot uh, get Uh, to import this take screenshot what happen uh, get screenshot as you have output type dot file and uh, you have to mention where the destination string destiny Uh, string dist equal to uh, system dot get property and uh, user dot dr it will give the current workspace your project location plus I have uh, I'll create uh, what is it one folder called error screenshots I'll place my uh, all the 
screenshots in the in this folder okay screenshot name plus dot png okay but this screenshot name is we are passing from this parameter okay which name you want uh, it is throwing add cast to file give me one second uh, you have to import this one import java.io and uh, file source what happened yeah it got added now uh, you have to take the destination where uh, you want to destination you have to get the destination of as a file yeah. now you have to copy file it is dot copy file from where it is it is from source and destination and now it will be through declaration now you have to return the path the reason is it is string the type is string we need to get where exactly the screenshot is place return destination in this destination i have my file okay so i have i have written the logic for to take the test case and to get the path of this uh, screenshot sorry uh, i have written the logic for to take the screenshot and to get the uh, path of the screenshot okay now i can use this method wherever you want to take the screenshot okay now uh, i'll write uh, a separate class to capture the screenshot and put it into the extent reports i'll name it as capturing screenshot okay and as this capturing screenshot okay here what i do i'll copy some code from the previous uh, classes please watch previous videos also for the you no know, sequence i uh, have this much logic is common is yes. uh, which are the classes which we use to uh, generate the extent report extend html report extend reports and extend test these are the three classes which we'll use to capture the uh, to generate the extend report and capture the information into that okay html report record new extend html report and you have to mention where exactly you want to generate your report and you have to add that information to your extent reports object extend that attach reporter html report okay now we'll write the actual test case uh, at the rate test um, public wide capture screenshot okay now what i'll do i have to take test equal uh, extent dot create test uh, this line should be the uh, first line in your every test case as without this it will not capture any information into the report okay by using this object only you can uh, create now i'll mention here i'll copy some code here like system dot set property gecko driver if you want to uh, launch uh, apart from these this i'll mention web driver driver reference okay I'll import this web driver and i'll use the same thing like here i'll import firefox driver also in system dot set property web driver dot kiko dot driver and where exactly the driver exe and driver equal new firefox driver driver dot get i'm navigating to uh, automation testing dot in and i'm capturing the title string title equal driver dot get title now i am asserting this value assert dot uh, assert equals and this is j unit 
I will take test engine. Okay, and I will mention this title here expected and the actual what exactly actual is. Okay, my actual I took something and I will place here. This is my actual. Okay, and if something goes wrong in my test case, how you will capture that information? Okay. For that, I'll import this test first. After each and every test method, I'll call this after method. Okay, to to get the results. Public void uh, get result. Uh, it will take test ng inter one of the test ng interfaces called i test result. Okay, I test result result. Okay, I have to import this I test result here. If result dot get status equal to equal uh, I test uh, result dot failure if the test case is failed what you need to do okay what you need to do <coughs> i have to capture the screenshot and i have to place in the extent report for that first i'll take the screenshot okay string uh, screenshot path is equal to i have uh, class called we have written the uh, utility right get screenshot okay get uh, screenshot it is a static uh, method we can directly call from using class name. Okay, get screenshot dot capture, and we need to pass the driver and the screenshot name, whatever name you want to put. Actually, okay, uh, I'll put my screenshot name is screenshot name. Okay, let it be screenshot name. Now uh, this line will capture the screenshot and it will return the screenshot path where exactly the screenshot is uh, saved ok now test dot fail ok test dot fail and we have discussed the same thing in the uh, previous uh, videos like mark up helper dot create label and I'll mention information like result dot get name plus test case failed. Okay, and I want to name extent color dot red. Okay. If something goes wrong in this, I am capturing that information and I am placing it to the extent report in the uh, in uh, uh, with background color of red, red background color. And test dot fail, and I have to mention uh, result dot. What is the exact error? I am mentioning the stack trace also. Get throwable will get that information, and Apart from all these things, our main crux here is we have to mention um, what you say screenshot okay. snapshot below and how you will take that test dot add screenshot screen capture from path where is that path screenshot path okay from this path I am adding that to extent report okay anyhow I will not mention if something goes pass or something goes skip uh, failure is enough for the reason is I am failing uh, deliberately here and it will come here it will take the screenshot and it will place in the uh, report okay after completion of this I have to flush that information to report for that what I will do I will take after test annotation once completion of your test, what I need to do, public void some tail down, 
and I'll mention extent the flush. Now, uh, till uh, test methods, <laughs> it will capture that information. Once you mention extent dot flush, it will flush that all information into the report. Okay. Now, I will execute uh, this one, and we will see whether it will capture the screenshot or not, and it will place. Okay. Uh, for that, before that, what I need to do, I have to uh, create a folder with error screenshots in the uh, your workspace. Okay, what is the this one? Right click, new folder, and I'll mention uh, and finish. Here, yeah, error screenshots. In this, the screenshot will uh, generated from this location. It will capture that and it will place into the extent reports. I'll take run as sorry this not this one capture screenshot I'll run as test ng test sorry it is open the browser completed yes it got completed and it failed ok see the screenshot got captured here if you double click this one see this is the screenshot the screenshot should be placed in the report uh, this is the report right I open the browser ok uh, capture screenshot test case failed and expected is home selenium webdriver appium computer tutorial but i have give, uh, found home automation test so title not match that is the reason it got filled now we will see here we can see the screenshot see screenshot capture in this location see here in this location screenshot, screenshot got captured okay and this way you can capture the screenshot and it will place wherever you want here I want to mention one important point. You took this report and you sent to somebody. Okay? Uh, your lead or your manager, your client, whatever it may be. You just, but if they open this report, they will not able to see this screenshot. Okay? The reason is, if you inspect this screenshot, you will get that uh, source equal users Krishna Saknala documents workspace extend reports error screenshots screenshot dot uh, name dot png means it is taking from here once you send this report to somebody the path will break the reason is the exact path and the screenshot will not be there in this location that is the reason it will not show this uh, screenshot in their report everything uh, apart from this uh, they will able to see every other information but they will not they, they cannot see this uh, screenshot okay you have to uh, remember that for that you need to if you want that uh, should be achieved then you have to buy this extent reports means pro version this is community version okay uh, but you, this way you can capture the screenshot and it can place in the extent reports okay uh, that's all in this video thank you for watching this video but don't forget to subscribe to automation testing channel and please like us at our Facebook page.